This is a section called Where's the Levitating Poet? Words can be funny, words can be true. There was a bridge built there, 1932. I think they used Middlesbrough Sea, literally. And the designers from Middlesbrough, in all honesty, it was the longest bridge of its time, it's true. And the people worked for years to do what they had to do. But it wasn't open in 1932. And they didn't harbour a grudge. And they enjoyed the view. They can't have been scared of heights, literally. I think I'll give it away. Hmm. Sydney was one of the construction workers, you see. <laughs> it was in a harbour, literally. Of course, it's Australia. Good day to Sheila's and all of it, I see. Good day, Australia. What can I say? I was there in 2005. I'd like to come back one day. If you want to pay my fare, it's true. I'll come and make a laugh with poetry, as only a UK poet can do. There's no other poet like me with a good sense of humour in all honesty. You can see the body, what can I say? I've got to laugh at it, I've got to look at it every day. So to all the Aussies I've got to say, I hope the weather's doing okay. I hope you're working hard and true. And I think you live in the best country, but what can a poor UK poet do? I'd love to come back someday, literally. But this time I'd like to go to the Opera House in all honesty. I'd like to go up the Blue Mountains, it's true. The rest of so beautiful. But I didn't have money last time I came, so what can I call before I do? So all the best from me to thee. And to all the Aussies and all the UK. Have a good day from me to thee. If you get the chance, what can I say? Walk across at me Arbor Bridge. It won't cost much that much in the modern day. So thank you from me to thee, and I hope you love my poetry. Thank you.